All right, bye. Christopher? Where is it? What? Oh, your Robin bobblehead is missing? Yes, 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 yes! It's embarrassing! Stop saying it out loud! Listen to this joke. What is green with wheels? I don't know. Grass. I lied about the wheels. <laughs> just, just tell me where the bobblehead is! Didn't say sell to Grandpa on that yard sale. Grandpa. Then the woman handed me my bag of groceries, and then I tied up the front of the bag, and I said, whoa, whoa! Sonny! What are you doing here? Can you give me that bobblehead that you bought in the yard sale? Why do you want that? Because it's mine, it was stolen from me. But I bought... Actually, yes. I'll give it back to you. If you go down to the police station and tell them not to arrest me because it's just a matter of time. Grandpa, what did you do? Uh, nothing too bad, I just didn't realize that robbery was illegal in other states too. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Good boy. Now if you could just leave for a second, I'm busy live streaming, so... What kind of cheese isn't yours? I don't know, Nacho? Stolen. <laughs> You're going to jail. Uh, what can I help you with? My grandpa, he did something really terrible. He didn't realize that stealing was illegal in other states, so if you could just do me a favor and not arrest him, that would be... I, I would do anything. There was a package that I ordered a very long time ago, and it is filled with the ashes of my dead partner's ashes. But I have not received that package in the mail. But if you can give me that package, I will give you your grandpa's freedom. Okay, I do know someone in the postal service. Okay, well tell them to give me my bowling ball. Wait, wait bowling ball? I thought that you wanted ashes. I'm in a joking kind of mood today. Really, I just want my bowling ball. Listen, Bob, I know you're the president of UPS, and my friend never got his bowling ball. Would you happen to know where it went? The, the ball, you mean the ball that you, you roll and it knocks the in the pin and go poof. Uh, I, uh, I, I stole it. Why would you steal his bowling ball? Well, you see, my aunt was very sick. She needed it. Okay, whatever. L listen, I just need it back. I, I, can, I can get it for you, but under one condition. Uh, what? I need you to bring me goat fur. It is very rare in my country. I went to buy some on eBay and some idiot outbid me at the last minute. Ooh, a goat fur coat and only three minutes remaining. Why not? What was so urgent that I had to come, like right now? I got you this. A goat fur coat? Yeah. Happy one year, four month, three week, two day and five minute anniversary. You remembered? If I get you your coat, you'll give me the bowling ball. No, not the coat, the goat. I need the goat fur. No, yeah, no, a goat fur coat. That's how I bought it. I, th that's that's how I can get it to you. Oh, fine. Get me the goat, and I will give you the stupid bowling ball. Listen, you know that fur coat that I got you? Yeah. I need it back. But you got that for me. I know, I know what I got that for, but I really need it back. Ugh, fine. You can have the fur coat if you get me a cardboard cutout of Harry Styles. They don't even sell those anymore. It's not my problem. It's yours now. What are we doing here? Like, I have a Pilates class with Richard Simmons in like 10 minutes. All right, look. Just sit down. I need to talk to you. What's going on? All right, look. I hate to ask you this, but... I need you to give me your Harry Styles cardboard cutout. What? No! I thought you were my best friend! Don't you understand I care about him? He's the most prized possession I have! No, if there's just anything that I could do, anything at all, I'll, I'll, I'll rub your feet for a month. No, he does that for me already, every night! You don't understand, I really need my bobblehead back and Grandpa won't give it to me and I had to go to the- Right, alright, there's one thing you could do for me. Anything. Seth sneaks into my room at night while I'm sleeping. He takes pictures of me, make weird faces when I sleep. It's about social networking. It really hurts my feelings. Okay, so if I get Seth to stop, you'll give me the cutout. Yeah, just do it. It hurts. <sighs> Seth, Seth, you need to stop taking pictures of Andrew while he sleeps. Why? He doesn't take cute sleep photos. J just stop. Well, how do you find out about it? You have a whole Instagram fan page dedicated to it. So no one knows about the website. What? J just stop taking pictures of it. No. Seth, that is creepy. What if I, um, what if I bought you a nice little pizza pie or something to make up for it? Mm-mm. 
Okay, then what do you want? 2,000 vintage stamps. Why do you need- I gotta ship something. Okay. Hurry up! <laughs> I heard you're the stamp guy. Do you mind if I just get, like, 2,000 vintage weird. stamps? Yeah, Yeah. okay, 2,000 vintage stamps. Sure. Thank uh, you. Why do you need 2,000 vintage stamps? It's a long story. Okay, that's fine, I got plenty of time with some oil. Why do you need 2,000 vintage stamps? Here. Here's your dumb release form. Now will you please give me back my Robin Bobblehead? Oh, Robin Bobblehead? I thought you said rock collection! Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, I lost that bobblehead thing a long time ago. Got mugged, actually. It's, uh, it's the only thing they stole. Oh, well, time for bed. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to click like, leave a comment down below letting us know what you thought. We read and respond to all of your comments, and subscribe for more videos coming soon. Special thanks to Chester C for being in this video and taking some time out of his day to help me film this. It means the world to me that he could do this. He's one of my favorite YouTubers. And also, shout out to Grace Helbig. I met her the same night. She is so sweet. They're both amazing people, and if you don't know who they are, what are you doing? Go subscribe to them and me. So that's about it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I personally think it's one of my favorites. And um, that's about it. I will see you guys next time. Back in 1983, me and my pals like Saki and uh, Pacey and Quincy AC. We would go bowling, uh, I bowled a 300, one, two, three, four, 11 times. And that is how I met my wife, Shardy. And you know what? She fell into my arms on that last pin and I carried her away to a beautiful bowling palace. <laughs> what is a beautiful bowling palace? That is where <laughs> people who really love each other take each other.